Good morning children. I hope you all are fine at your place. Let us perform an activity to show that the shape of the shadow depends upon the shape of the object. Are you ready kids? Let's start. Switch on a beam of torch light in a dark room and point it towards a ball or an orange so that you can see its shadow on the wall. Now remove the ball and place a bottle in its place keeping the torch at the same position. You can see the shadow of the bottle as you have placed the bottle in place of an orange or a ball keeping the torch fixed. You will see that a different shape of a shadow is formed this time. This activity shows that the shape of the shadow depends upon the shape of the object. Let us perform another activity which shows that the shape of the shadow depends upon the direction of the light source. Switch on a small beam of torch light on a wall in a dark room and point it towards a bottle or any other object. Mark the shadow on the wall. Now change the direction of the torch keeping the position of the bottle same. Again note down the shadow of the bottle on the wall. You will see some shape of the shadow have been changed. This shows that the shape of the shadow depends upon the direction of the light source. Let us perform the third activity to show that the size of the shadow depends upon the size of the object. Switch on a beam of torch light in a dark room and point it towards a small ball. Look at the shadow of the ball. Now replace the small ball with a big ball keeping the position of the torch and the ball same. You will see that a bigger size of shadow is formed on the wall. This shows that the size of the shadow depends upon the size of the object. A big object makes a larger shadow as compared to the smaller object. Let us perform the fourth activity to show that the size of the shadow depends upon the distance of the object from the source of light. Switch on a beam of torch light in a dark room and point it towards an orange kept at a distance of 1 meter away from the torch. Observe the shadow of the orange on the wall. Note the size of the shadow. Now shift the orange to the distance of 2 meters away from the torch. Keep the position of the torch same. Again, observe the shadow of the orange on the wall. Do you find the shadow of similar size? No, the size of shadow is much smaller now. This shows that the size of the shadow depends upon the distance of the object from the source of light. In this module, we have learnt that the shape of the shadow depends upon the shape of the object and the direction of the light source. We have also learnt that the size of the shadow depends upon the size of the object and the distance of the object from the source of light. I hope you have enjoyed and understood the concept. Thank you kids.